Hey, what's up guys? Aaron here, and today we're going to be talking about five tips and tricks that you must know about Android Wear. So, as we all know, Android Wear is a fairly new platform, so with that being said, there's plenty of features to learn. So, without further ado guys, let's go ahead and get started. So, number one is how to blacklist apps in Android Wear. So, the first thing that you're going to notice when wearing an Android Wear smartwatch and that being a LG G Watch or a Samsung Gear Live or the upcoming Moto 360 are which notifications are important and which notifications can simply be brushed aside. Now the good news is that it's easy to keep particular applications from sending you notifications. Now Google went the smart route and made the Android Wear app the gatekeeper for all of your notifications on your Android Wear smartwatch. So with that being said, all you have to do is open the Android Wear app Go to settings and then mute apps and scroll through the apps till you find the app that you want to mute and then press on it. Now the only bad news is that you have to mute one app at a time. So next number two is how to send a text message using Android Wear. Now first off it doesn't matter if you have the Gear Live, the LG G3 or the up and coming Moto 360. It is the same particular method to send a text message with all three devices. So to send a text message using Android Wear you have a couple different options with the easiest being just to tell your watch to do it using voice commands. However, a more manual way is to just tap into the actions list and then choose send a text option. You'll then be asked to whom you want to send the message to and what message you would like to send. Next number three is how to take a note on Android Wear. So taking a note on a smartwatch whether Android Wear or not should be as easy as saying take a note and on the Android Wear platform it is. So to take a note all you need to do is tap on the device or raise the device up which will wake the device up and bring up the voice prompt. Then say take a note, wait for the prompt and then dictate your note or you can say it all at once. Next number four is how to extend the battery life on Android Wear. Now first off, lowering the brightness on your display is gonna be an immediate way to save battery. And another simple way to save battery is to turn off the always on mode. And lastly, number five is how to use an Android Wear smartwatch as a stopwatch. Now there's a simple stopwatch feature that's built into every Android Wear device that lets you time just about anything. While the stock Android Wear stopwatch is pretty basic, the lack of a lap timer is a bit of a drag. However, the Gear Live offers a heart rate monitor as well as a stopwatch. And I'm excited to see what Motorola is going to do in the Moto 360 when it comes to a stopwatch. Anyways guys, that's going to do it for me. This has been 5 tips and tricks that you must know about Android Wear. Like I said before, I'm Aaron and I'll see you guys on the next one.